Discovery of Java Man, Sangiran Early Man Site. Sangiran in central Java, Indonesia, is a peaceful rural area. Long ago, this area was actually under the sea, but gradually became marshland. The land emerged from the sea about 200,000 years ago and exposed a strata formed between 500,000 and 800,000 years ago. Many fossils have been found here. In the 19th century, a Dutchman came here. He was seeking some unusually large bones rumoured to have been discovered in the area. He was a doctor called Eugene Dubois. After studying anatomy and geology, he left for Indonesia, which was then a Dutch colony. Several decades earlier, Darwin's book on the origin of the species had been published. In it, he made public his theory that humans had evolved from apes. Since many fossils had already been found in Indonesia, Dubois believed that he would find a fossil that connected humans and apes here, too. Dubois immediately wrote an article about his discovery and named this species Pitecanthropus erectus, which means standing ape man. His discovery received little attention, but his theory was recognised when Peking man fossils were found in China. Many excavation teams came to the Sangiran area in search of Java man fossils. This is one of the best preserved Java man fossils and clearly shows the facial area. Research has revealed that its brain size was about twice as large as a chimpanzee and two-thirds the size of a human brain. From the shape of the head, it's believed they may have had some language capacity. As excavations continue in Sangaran, one or two significant discoveries are made every year most of the Java man fossils have been found in this quiet farm village area, but Sangaran is a real treasure trove of early human history. <laughs>